My second flight of the DJI Win 4 with the FLIR Duo Pro integrated through Lightbridge on it. Uh, it's really nice. I uh, got this from the guys at Fly High USA. But uh, you got the DJI expansion kit on this thing. And um, of course, I got my, my Titan system to get a little bit better transmission. But um, here, it is, and here it is coming through a crystal sky. Uh, it's really pretty nice. It's a little bit windy today. You can probably see the trees moving a little bit, probably about maybe uh, 10 mile an hour winds. Uh, the wind four is right up there, and it doesn't care at all about the wind. It just kind of stays there. That's kind of to be expected, right? Um, but anyway, this uh, it's pretty nice. I, I can take and move uh, one of these knobs over here, and I can get some pan, go back and forth. I'm getting a little bit of sunlight over there. There I am down there. And then uh, the knobs are a little bit different than what we're used to with DJI. They, if you put some pan on it, it'll stay panning. So see, I'll do that and I'll let go. There's my hand. And it's just going to pan around until I bring it back to neutral. So that's kind of good in a way if you're trying to catch a, a pan shot or just wanted to kind of keep going around and looking. You don't have to hold it. Uh, you just put it in position. Then you, and then when it returns to center, you probably hear that beep. That's whenever it stops. And then you can do the same thing with the tilt. So I'm going to tilt down, stop when you hear the beat, and then tilt up, and again, stop whenever you hear the beat. Um, so that's really nice. That's done with, with my outside knob. And these things are actually configurable, which is kind of cool. So you can, it's not just uh, stuck to whatever it is. You can set these things up uh, to whatever your preference. So the next knob that I have over here on the left um, I have that set up for a digital optical zoom, which is kind of nice. So you can see here we zoom in and zoom in again. Um, it actually works really well. You can see the stabilization there is actually working really well. I mean, we do get just a little bit of pixelation, but believe it or not, that, that digital zoom works really nice, especially for public safety. You can see the door over there uh, very well. And so if you were looking to see if that was a a uh, missing person or suspect or whatever you might be um, you have that digital zoom capability um, so the next knob that I have over on this side so that was that was this knob so I have it set up for pan and tilt on the outside um, I have this one set up for the optical zoom and I have the next one uh, right over here set up to change between picture and picture um, uh, optical and thermal so let's kind of change this one now we're in full thermal now we're in my favorite which is picture in picture so I'm looking at the same thing um, with my optical and my thermal um, and we're looking at the the same uh, the, the other the other, I have one more switch set up uh, we have we have these three inputs configurable through Bluetooth and my last switch is over here on on this side and this allows me to switch between this is isotherm so if I pan over here I'll probably isotherm yep there you go so you can see me isotherm Let's see if I can get in you can see me isotherm sitting right there on my on my porch so that's pretty awesome and this is in the kind of in the middle of the day or in the afternoon early afternoon I guess so um, yeah, that's, uh, that's pretty outstanding. You can see me there, and you can see me right over here. Isotherm, right? And I can switch, switch change color palettes by just flipping that switch. So, that's uh, some really nice stuff. Looks like the sun started going down a little bit. All right. Anyway, so far it's working really good. Um, Still got to do a lot more testing on it, but right now it's looking like I'm ready to put this one in operation and uh, get it out on either some fire or police incidents and see how it performs uh, in the field. It's one thing to test here right out in front of my house. It's another whenever uh, we've got to get it going and it has to work 100% and perfect at all times. So anyway, thought I'd share and uh, got any questions, go ahead and ask.